Hey guys, what's up? It's Solo, and today uh, I'm going to be talking about something that's kind of stupid about the whole Hell Divers 2 thing. And no, I'm not talking about the PSN thing. That thing's over. That is completely over. It's done. Like that that th that ship sailed. Sony somehow miraculously actually stepped away and stepped back from it and said, "Okay, we're not going to do it anymore." No, let's talk about the people denying about the whole death threat things or the people telling the devs to kill themselves. Um, so I have, I only took four of these, or three, because one's, somebody else is telling, like, talking about it. But I have three different screen captures I took exactly from the Discord of Helldivers during the entire events of what happened. And holy shit. So there are people on X or Twitter who are actively trying to deny that people were telling not only the devs, but other people to kill themselves during this whole thing. And there are people denying this, saying that there is no proof, and you can't prove it, and that the people who are saying this stuff are just people who are on Arrowhead's dick and blah, 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 blah. Well, here are four different screenshots, again, from the Twitter of people saying this. One talking about a message that was actually um, deleted by the moderation team saying to the arrowhead devs to kill themselves and i'm gonna be the first one to say it a i shouldn't have to be the one to pull all this information and then put it up for people to see to know that this is happening i get the whole well you know innocent until proven guilty mentality i get that but also like it should have never been in the question like ever during this entire thing it shouldn't have been in the question that this is even happening I know some people have issues with some of the CMs I know there was an ex dev who was going on a witch hunt during the entire thing and if he ever watches this um, I'm just gonna call him Tony it's not his real name uh, of course but Tony if you're ever watching this I fucking hope you never make another game because what you did during this is ridiculous. And I hope that you sitting there begging for them to patch Stellar, Stellar Blade so then you can see all the skin imaginable or whatever. And then asking people for money during this whole time. I hope your thing gets revoked for you to get money from Twitter. Because god damn are you toxic as hell. I've never seen somebody sit there and go up and down with a topic before in my life like this to the point where fucking toxicity is high, but like this guy 100% did that. Taking tweets that weren't even a part of this whole conversation and making them be like, well, these things are bad type shit. And then turning around and saying, oh, well, can you guys give me money because I'm taking so much heat on Twitter? Grow up. God, I've never seen somebody ask for handouts after single-handedly trying to harass the dev team of their beloved game. And then also sitting there complaining about Stellar Blade. I don't give a fuck about the Stellar Blade thing, by the way. I just don't care. Um... But yeah, so the fact that I had to pull all this is dumb. And I'm going to put this plain and simple on my channel. A, I will never support harassment, threats, or telling any dev or anyone else to kill themselves on my channel or elsewhere. B, if I absolutely have to, I will pull screenshots and things like that to prove that people are doing these things. Even if it's kind of ridiculous that I do have to pull screenshots. And mind you, this is these are only like four examples out of many. And a lot of the people were actually responding like that one guy was to the initial message. They were like, whoa, dude, that's a lot to say to a dev team. But like, yeah, it takes a few bad apples to ruin things. And there are definitely quite a few bad apples when it comes to the Discord of Helldivers. Community well praised for its wholesomeness, especially over time. It's kind of weird to see some of them turn into absolute incels who think that telling people to kill themselves is an easy and adequate thing to do. 
And the fact of the matter is, is I'm very disappointed with how people are reacting to the situation, calling quote unquote for proof that things are amiss. And it's like, dude, it's the gaming world. There are always going to be people who are doing this shit because they think it's okay. Like, it's been in the gaming world since the beginning of fucking competitive gaming. And it's probably going to stay there the entire time. And the fact that I have to prove it to you just means that you guys are more ignorant than I thought. But yeah, so that has been my day. Uh, I'm going to be real. Um, yeah. If anyone comes onto my channel saying, oh, well, that didn't happen. These screenshots are bullshit. Shut the fuck up. I'm just going to, like... I, I will fully admit to you, if your arguments are going to be this thing of just insulting me as a person and adding no substance, I'll delete your comment. I do not care. Because there is a way to tell if someone's argument is just going to be pure insults and nothing of substance. And the fact that I, like... And making this video and I know that there's probably going to be some person who's chronically online sitting on their Twitter or their YouTube and are going to comment that this shit doesn't happen or that this isn't enough proof is fucking ridiculous. But anyway, so my final message for the day for anyone who's listening to this still, A, don't be a dick. Just don't be a dick. Like... The whole Helldiver situation, I understood why people were upset. I got it. Originally, I didn't get it, and then I learned. That's how people learn. But now I do get it. And now I do get why, you know, PlayStation should have backed down sooner. You know, I understand that. And to the people who were sitting there defending Sony to their last breath and saying that PC games like this shouldn't come to PC if people are going to complain about account linking, I don't care. I really just don't care. Sony has already proven to us that they're not the greatest when it comes to being a publisher or even helping development teams, so I don't care. Either way, whatever helps like gamers play the fucking game, I'm going to support. But yeah, at the end of the day, don't be a dick. Don't send death threats. Don't threaten people. Don't fucking... Be a dick in general and fucking have fun playing Helldivers 2 now that this whole situation is being averted. And hopefully I'm, I haven't gotten confirmation that the like rest of the countries are able to purchase Helldivers again. Uh, I hope we'll get that in the coming like hours, but I have no idea. But anyway, guys, I think I'm going to leave the video there. If you guys did enjoy the video, hit the like button. Comment down below. Um, what thing about the new War Bond, because that comes out next week, are you excited about? I think I'm excited mostly with the uh, like therm new Thermite Grenade. That looks pretty cool. But yeah, let me know in the comments below. And guys, I will see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.